The vast majority of horizontal wells require a flow path to pump down frack plugs or utilize coiled tubing shifting tools. The most common solution is to use a tow port positioned one or two joints above the float collar. While this approach generally serves its purpose, it's not unusual to encounter issues with cement stringers left down hole, potentially inhibiting the functionality of the tow port. The process of remediating cement stringers can be not only costly, but also a significant drain on time. Such complications can result in need to do a motor and mill trip, having to tractor guns to TD, or potentially forgoing one or more frack stages. One of the most common ways to help avoid cement stringers is to run double or triple extended length cement displacement plugs. A prominent challenge when employing longer cement displacement plugs is sourcing extended height cement heads to facilitate the deployment of longer plugs. The floor launcher is a proprietary system designed to be temporarily installed on the rig floor, directly below a standard cement head. The floor launcher can be dressed with any combination of double, triple, or quadruple length hollow core cement displacement plugs. Cementing operations are conducted as normal. The pre-flush and cement slurries are pumped through the lower inlet on the cement head and through the hollow core of the plug train hanging in the floor launcher housing. Following the pumping of the cement stage, the lower inlet on the cement head is closed and the top cement displacement plug in the cement head is launched. This plug latches into the floor launcher plug train. Pressure builds to 1000 PSI, which shears the plug train hanger, and the full plug train is then pumped down hole with clean fluid where it latches into the shoe track. Contact your Variegate Technologies sales rep for further information.